Seven. Today in grammar, we are going to learn about kind of sentence. Okay. I am wearing a pink dress. Remember, uh, we are going to talk about, and I told you, different kind of sentence. What is that? You need to recognize what is a kind of sentence first. It says different kind of sentence that we need to understand what kind of sentence. There are different. If you remember, I don't remember if we talk about that. You need to recognize declarative sentence when you are declaring something. We talk about something. Uh, now, all the time, the declarative sentence ends with a period. If you look, this is a period. The period is a point. The period is a, okay? This is a period. I am wearing a pink. I am deplorable. I She is using a declarative sentence. I am wearing a pink dress. I am wearing a green shirt. You are wearing a gray t-shirt or the gray t-shirt. Um, the girls are wearing a pink t-shirt, right? For that reason, it's declarative, okay? We talk about something. I am wearing a pink dress. Jake to make an important decision. This sentence ends with that period too. If you remember the story about the Jake's decision, he needs to make an important decision, an important decision because he needs to think, oh my God, I need to cross a river. What am I going to do? He needs to take an important decision. I am using a declarative sentence. Don't worry, don't remember, don't forget that a declarative sentence talk about Something. Continue. Interrogative sentence. Ask about something. It ends with a question mark. This is the question mark. For example, what are you eating with your sister? Oh, where did you go to eat? Where are you eating with your sister? Okay, I am eating. Uh, in Pizza Hut with my sister, I am eating in Domino's Pizza, or I am eating in, tell me another place that they do pizza, guys. Do you remember another place? Domino's, uh, I say Domino's, um, Pizza Hut, what more? Uh, Christian Hernandez, tell me, please. Pabayon. Papayons, very good, thank you. Someone else, do you remember? And you eat pizza, maybe I am eating hamburger in different places in McDonald's. We eat a hamburger or another Burger King or whatever place that you want. But the reason is Yeshua, tell me, Yeshua. Tell me, Yeshua. Yeshua? Leonardo, teacher. Leonardo, excellent, excellent, very good, yes. What are you eating with your sister? I am eating in a restaurant. I am eating in a pizza place, or I don't know, whatever. Because you need to make a question. Continue. Did Jay have to make an important decision? Yes, he need to make an important decision because he need to recognize that he let the chicken with the fox, that is a big problem. And he, let, he lets the curd with the chicken, that is a big problem too. For that reason, Jay to make a big decision. Did Jay have to make an important decision? Yes, he did. Next one. The imperative sentence tells someone to do something. Or oh, it's an it ends with a period too. When we are talking about imperative sentence, we need give a comment to make requests. D a day and all the time with a period too. Okay, example, look at that. Wash the dishes. Ethan, wash the dishes now, please. Okay, I give a comment. Anthony, clean the room, please. Clean your room. Mess. Perfect. I say, Gabriela, do your homework now. 
Yes, because I keep a comma. Sit down, please. It's tough. Okay? That is a give Or oh, maybe you use a uh, you call it or maybe some more thing. They say and they scream. Thank you. They say I'm a scream. And that, that is not good for me. Because when you speak to someone, uh, you are doing that is not good. That what's this, please? Another okay. If you remember a uh, Jake's decision, he needs to cross the river, bring back the chicken to the he needs the chicken to the far, and he needs to cross the river. Okay. And now the one exclamatory sentence. Exclamatory sentence, they show the strong feelings. Okay. They show the strong feelings, and it ends with an exclamation mark. If you look here, I have an exclamation mark in that part. For example, the dog is cute. It's so amazing. The dog is cute. Because my husband likes to speak in Guadalajara, she is speaking. I say, I am in class, this silence. I am using an imperative system. Don't make me because I am in class, okay? That's this. Okay, look at the dog skill. Oh, one must use exclamatory sentence. I am using the dog is cute. Do you like that? Yes, I am. Do you like it? Yes or no? What is que se le escucha se le escucha recordado, profe? Is the dog cute? Yes or no? What? Yo, is cute. Cute. Yes or no? Um. Yes, I cute the dog. It's cute, it's cute dog. Okay, dog is cute. Number two, the fox is looking at the chicken. And the chicken is eating, oh my God, that's incorrect. Give me a second. It's eating the corn, no, eating, no, with H. I don't use that. It's eating. Yes, sorry. The, the dog, the, sorry. the fox is looking at the chicken. And the chicken is eating the corn. Don't forget, guys, we need to recognize declarative sentence or a statement. We talk about something, they end with a period. Okay, for example, you have to make an indication. What is sentence about something, they end with an action. They have to make an important decision. What your name, where are you from? A very sentence, you command or make requests. Thank you. Consider about the chicken part. Don't play with that. Sit down, please. Respect to the teacher. Follow the teacher instruction. Stand up. Raise your hand. Eat your food. All the time we use imperative sentences. And then we ask my mother. The fox is not there. She can eat in the core. Or you, you know, the fox is looking at the chicken. Oh, the fox is looking at the chicken. Oh, the chicken is saying, wonderful. Look at this guy. It's beautiful. Okay. We use comment, a exclamatory, a exclamation mark. Okay, let's go to practice. You need to recognize exclamatory, declarative, interrogative, and imperative. You look in your book, book, page 99, you have example. Okay, number one, don't stop, don't stop. Ita, exclamatory, declarative, or imperative. Ita, John, Job, Dosavo. Tell me. John, Job, Dosavo, exclamatory, declarative, imperative, imperative. Declarative. Thing is declarative. Uh, someone else, another opinion, have another opinion? If you know, raise your hand if it's different because it can say it's declarative. John drop those apples. Tell me, raise your hand if you know it's different. Exclamatory, declarative. What do you think? John drop those apples. Teacher, a mí no me parece lo mismo en la página 99. Yes, don't worry. Let me choose declarative, imperative, 
interrogative or, or exclamatory. Yeah, 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 yeah. Don't show up. What is exclamatory, declarative, or interrogative, operative? Okay, it can say is exclamatory. Use one. Oh my God, what thinking? So, Anil, what do you think? Don't drop those apples. Yeah. Declarative. Okay. Declarative. Okay, yes. Is a is a exclamatory. Exclamatory. Okay. Okay, guys. We need to practice because I explain the class. Ale, what do you think? That is not exclamatory. It no, is not declarative. You need to use interrogative or imperative. Imperative. What do you say? No, no, it's interrogative or imperative. What is Christian Fernandez? Eh. Interrogative. Thank you for participating, Boris. Great. Guys, don't is a imperative you are giving you are giving a comment don't drop those apple you say that please it's imperative because you are using a comment don't drop those apple or maybe it's or maybe it's exclamatory because don't drop those apple maybe like this maybe like this don't scare a person away what's don't scare the person away. Gabriela? Imperative. Imperative. Excellent. Do you have your own computer base? What is Do you have your own computer? It's a maturity, interrogative, or imperative? Interrogative. Because it's interrogative. Because they have a question mark. Interrogative. 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 Yes, it's correct, because you have a question mark. Please be careful. Please be careful. Ita, exclamatory, declarative, interrogative, imperative. Exclamatory. Excellent, exclamatory. And now, it's correct, because you, sorry, because you said, please be careful. And I'm gonna write exclamation point there. Continue. Hey, where is next one? Um, wait a moment. Anthony, what is the first letter of the alphabet? Exclamatory, declarative, interrogative, imperative. What um, is the first letter of the alphabet? Antoine? Declarative. What do you say? Declarative. Do you think declarative doesn't have another opinion? What do you think? Jose Avera. Tell me, what is the first letter of the alphabet? Interrogative. Yes, yes. Very good because it has a question mark. Continue. Catch we match. Can we match a moving tonight? Can we match a move tonight? Uh, Sophia. Can we match a movie tonight? Is exclamatory, declarative, interrogative, or imperative? Sophia. Oh, Sophia, Masia is coming. I am. Ah, okay, you have a problem. Okay, Jason. Sophia has a problem with the microphone. 
Can we match the movie a moon night? A clarity, poverty, exclamatory, what is your? Uh, in the interrogative. Very good, interrogative. It's excellent, thank you. Okay, guys, do you need to continue watch the video and you need to copy in your book number seven. Go to your class right now. Number eight, tomorrow we are going to the zoo. Number nine, today is a very sunny day. Number 10, my name is Francis. Number 11, wow, that looks amazing. Number 12, what's your name? Number 13, please open the door. Number 14, do you like chocolate cake? Number 15, come down to eat breakfast. Okay, you need to use, it. you need to choose, is exclamatory, is declarative, is interrogative, or is imperative when we finish this. Class. Do you have a question, Ida? Teacher, uh, the 12th and the 14th are, are interrogative. Uh, the 12th and the 14th. 14, 14. 14. Okay. Yeah. Yes, correct. Thank you because you are analyzed. Thank you so much. Yes, correct. You need to finish. Okay, I have more. You need to watch the video. I repeat. Number one, I had a great time with my family. Do you have a book? Help me. Do you do your homework? Do your homework. Where do you live? Give me a hug. I have a blue pen and two notebook. I think it's pen, not pen. Because we don't try with a pen. What's your name? I am so happy to be finished with my work. Me. Yesterday, I went to Oregon to visit my sister. And I have more. Choose and write a kind of sentence. What you need to do in you're at home. You need to work at home. You need to choose declarative, interrogative, exclamatory, and imperative. Number one, do you like to play? Go to your room. Can you help me, please? The green frog hops. What is a party? Give me that pencil. We like to eat cake. This is so much fun. Stop doing that. I love you so much. He can kick the, he can kick the ball. I won the game, okay? You need to choose if, for example, do you like to play? I'm gonna write there here in the part. I think, what is, do you like to play? What is that, guys? Declarative, interactive, exclamatory, or interactive? What do you think? Repeat, do you, do you like to play? What is that? Do you like to play? Yeah, teacher. Do you like to play? I use that. That is interrogative. Yeah, you need to write at home. You need to do a square. Do, sorry. Do you like to play? You need to write in that group because it's, it's a robot. Okay? Number two, go to your room. Jeshua, go to your room. What is that? Exclamatory, imperative, or declarative? Go to your room. It's um imperative. Go to your room. Go to your room. And you write there. You need to continue to remember it's imperative. You use a period and the end. Go to your room. Oh, go to your room, please. That's correct. Okay. You need to continue at home. This is a practice guy. The practice. I'm gonna check after. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Cool.